Breast Cancer Awareness Month, a time when many of us will be pinning on pink ribbons to raise the profile of the disease. But one group of women fighting metastatic breast cancer, that's the advanced stage, is taking a more radical approach. <laughs> My name is Champagne Joy, and I'm the creator of and resident in Cancerland. Cancerland is a group of women with breast cancer who help other women with breast cancer. It's Breast Cancer Awareness Month. This is the time of year where you get the bag of Doritos with a pink ribbon on it. We call it pink washing, where it is made to be a pretty disease. It's not pretty. Okay, I've got the invitation for the event. I just 108 women die of metastatic breast cancer every single day in this country. We need to look at it like the AIDS crisis. I am a trumpet player. Tomorrow morning I'm leaving and I'll be going to the West Coast for a series of dates with Gloria Gaynor. Right after I married my husband, um, I went in for a mammogram, <clears throat> and uh, it was a little crazy. So I had been married a month, and I was like, oh, great, now I'm dying. And sometimes we just have to hurt. Yeah, I know. I'm learning. I'm learning. I think a lot of doctors know what they studied in school, and they forget that it's a person. Cancerland is so interesting because it's, it's women who have this disease and don't let it ruin their lives. I will not be going to chemotherapy and radiation. I'm choosing quality over quantity. I was diagnosed after I had gotten back from the motorcycle races on the Isle of Man. This month is very difficult for me because uh, Everywhere I go, I'll, I see reminders that I have breast cancer. Um, all of that money that is being raised, it, it's not coming to the aid of those who have metastatic breast cancer. The standard course of treatment for a survivable breast cancer to a woman out of pocket is a quarter of a million dollars in the first year. And we're the generation that is going to complain. The women of Cancerland fighting to raise awareness of the metastatic version of the disease. Now, how would you?